All right, good morning, everybody. Um, I'm on my way back to um, Nikki and John's old house. Finish what I started. This time I don't have a time restriction. Had to get the uh, uh, power washer back to Home Depot before it was too late, and I did. I got it there. Uh, only got had to pay for one day. Thank goodness. And uh, so. Um, what I plan on doing is um, tearing down everything that's there, knocking it down so it, it um, will fit into the bed of my truck easier. Gonna do one more run to the um, landfill, and if there's anything left over after that, then it's just gonna come home with me. And hopefully it'll, it'll take less time than, than what I had to do with yesterday. So. I brought a blower, so I know I'm going to make a, a mess while doing all this, so instead of washing it down, I have a um, grass blower. I'll just take care of it that way and uh, leave it nice and clean and ready to move in, which is the plan. So Val is very depressed. She's. Uh, I'm sure all of you know by now, uh, Val is manic depressive or um, has uh, bipolar disorder. And um, she swings back and forth. And uh, now she's in her depressed mode. And it's pretty bad because of finances and everything else that just adds to it. Plus, uh, I'm not home. And uh, this is the, t the time that I really, really, really want to be home when she's uh, depressed like this. But uh, I have to get this job done. So I'll take you guys along, tear it down, and I will get home as soon as possible. back at the job and here is what's left from what I didn't take yesterday and uh, what I need to do to make this work is cut the stuff up so that I can easily put it in the back of my truck and take it. I'm going to do one more run to the uh, landfill. Uh, I'm going to probably keep one of these little desks because I need one upstairs for the business. You've got to decide which one is in the best shape. So, and whatever I can't get into the truck for the final uh, run is going to go home with me. problem yesterday and um, still gonna be a problem today but I brought a very sharp knife and I'm gonna cut it into pieces to make it easier for me to move it so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to clean underneath I couldn't get it all the way into the side there so I'll have to do some cleanup afterwards
that's it, ready to roll. And let me see what time it is. It is 2.26, which is good timing. I will get this to the dump. And this is what's going home with me. So, not a lot left. I can either keep it or get rid of it, or sell it, or whatever. But everything in there is junk. Okay, so it took me about two hours to load this truck. Mainly because of that carpet. I had to cut it all up and it was soaking wet. But uh, it'll probably take me about 10 minutes to unload it. Which is, uh, I guess, cool. It cost $48. And that's a minimum charge here for uh, a load, but that's because I'm in Los Angeles. I know that it's cheaper in uh, Riverside County, Corona, where I live. Ah, uh, the seagulls love this stuff, huh? All right, it took me more than 10 minutes to uh, do this. It took me almost a half hour, but that doesn't matter because this is done. And everything else is going home with me. Yay! All right, so I'm done. And here it is. Cleaned up. Washed out. And I still have stuff going home with me. So it's about 4.20. I'm going to start my way home. It's going to be heavy traffic. Val's already upset that I'm not home already, but uh, this was a bigger uh, job than I anticipated. So I'll probably be there around uh, 5.30. Alright, so I'm finally home. It's been a really, really, really long day. Um, Val's still not feeling well and she's asleep again. So uh, tomorrow I will be home. So let's see how that works out. And uh, so I hope uh, you liked something in this video. If you did, give us a thumbs up. Get, uh, don't forget to share it with your friends and relatives. And don't forget to subscribe. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye.